Have you heard about the really fun bento lunch boxes? These are so great because they're just portable, they're easy to carry. Um, they usually have a really nice elastic cover. And what I like about them is that you can mix and match. So maybe I'm just gonna be gone for like five, six hours one day and I only want a smaller lunch, I just take one. Maybe I'm gonna be gone for 12 hours because I've got some extra things going on and I need more food, you can take two. So lots of great options. Um, the top actually comes off as a plate. And then of course you can actually use the tops of each of these to come off as a plate. When you're taking these off, you're generally going to want to pull from the corner, not the tab. The corner actually helps release the really nice gasket that's on here, so it works much, much better. Um, when they first come, they're going to be a little tight. After a while, they loosen up and will be a lot nicer for you, so it just depends what you're looking for. Um, okay, ooh, and you know what? Pamper Chef, you can actually get these as a separate accessory. Pamper Chef actually has these um, as part of a salad set that we have and they fit right into the top so you've got a spoon and a fork so that is really neat the other option i've done is just grab like a really simple wooden toothpick a lot of the things in a bento box unless you're doing a salad are usually things that are um just kind of grazing type things and um honestly a toothpick will actually handle a lot of it but the spoon and the fork actually do come in handy too so now let's say i want to add some things and i want to add nuts and cheese and maybe some carrots I don't necessarily want it all mixing in around here. So look how cool this is. For a couple bucks, I just went on Amazon, bought some silicone um, cupcake, actually cupcake um, pieces. You get two of each color. There's a total of 12. And these actually are beautiful because now you don't have to worry about food spilling all over, mixing up. Um, I've even got some chicken salad in here, just a small amount. I'm a huge fan of grazing. So I can throw that in here. Now I'm not gonna suggest that you do something like maybe a salad dressing that's really really runny because if you tip this it's going to go all over but you could do something thicker like you could do a schmear of hummus in here you could do a schmear of a cream cheese or a flavored cream cheese something that's thicker and heavier and that would work really really good um, I've got some carrots. We have this cool crinkle cutter. Have you guys ever seen this? Um, but we have, I don't know if you can even see it, but yeah, you can see the crinkles in here. I use this to cut up, um, actually cheese cubes are really great for that. So I didn't use it this time for the ones I have in here, but I use it for my carrots. It's just fun. It's something different. Um, maybe I want to tuck in a little granola bar or you know what, maybe I want um, to grab a couple of crackers so I could throw some crackers in here. And of course I can put them in there or put them in here. It just depends what I want to do. Um, maybe pickles, you know, hubby likes pickles. So I could throw a couple of pickles in here and that would be great for him. Or you know what, maybe I just want to take two Oreos, you know, and throw the Oreos in here, the granola bar, and um, maybe a handful of nuts. So really you can pick and choose how much food you have in here. You can choose how you do it. I do like those Amazon um, silicone cupcake holders um, just because it helps me feel a little organized and I don't just want to dump all the food in here. So pretty simple, pretty easy. I can pop my lids on. Oops, ah, lid. Um, I can throw a toothpick in here. I can throw the spoon and fork in here. I can pop the lid on and I can put the band on and I'm good to go. And like I said, you can take one or both, whatever works. But let me know if you have any questions. But this is Pamper Chest Bento Box and this is Amy with more helpful tips in the kitchen. Thanks.